Okay, I've had a lot of work today, so this is kind of taking longer than I expected. So what I what I did is uh, I took this side here with a lip, and I put it face down. I filled it with sand, and now I have the wax here, which I made from Kevin Potter's mold. And so I'm going to place that there and I'm going to push it in. Just with my fingers here. It actually comes right out of there. So it's certainly not stuck in there. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it out and add a little more powder back in there. Put it back in. Take the other side. Make sure there's nothing in the channel. Line it up. Fit it down in there. Make sure there's powder on this side of the wax. Take the sand, push it down in there. You can try this different ways. I've tried hammering it, but with the with the wax like this. I've almost found that just pushing it with my thumb is works better. Seems to not stick to the wax as much as the hammering does. So I'm just going to push it down with my thumb. And I'm going to scrape it off. Okay, take that out of there. Okay, now we want to pop it apart. Sometimes it helps to kind of wedge a little knife in there, kind of free it up. Okay, so we have, that looks great. We got that half there, then we have this half, and you know, by not pounding it, you can kind of see where it didn't fill as well. But we can kind of take this dapping tool here, kind of push that down a bit. This doesn't matter because no metal is going to go in there. It's just a tiny bit around the inside of the ring that's missing. Not, not hardly any. So we'll just kind of take the back of the tweezer, clean that up a little bit, blow it off. Sand moved a little bit right there, but I can fix that. I will say this works a lot better when I'm not doing a video, because when I'm doing a video, I'm trying to do it faster than normal. OK, 
to. I'm just going to leave it like that. So now by doing this, I've pushed a little bit of sand into the pattern. That's got to come back out. You want things as smooth as possible. Okay, that half looks pretty good. This side's dynamite. It's really good. Man, that worked good. Okay, take the other half, line it up, set it down, keep it together. Clamp it in place. Try and get this where you can see better.
You want to kind of move it around to get the metal on the bottom that's still solid. Keep the tip up here nice and hot. Okay, so we we'll pour it quick here. I had way more than enough metal. As you can see, I got a big chunk there. Dump that out. Okay, I would have to say overall that's pretty good casting. A little bit of stuff on the center, that'll be easy to clean off. Bottom looks good. Casting overall looks pretty good. A little flashing just from where the sand is placed a little bit. Overall, I'd say that's pretty good. And the next thing we'll do is finish it. Thank you.